What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another episode. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to use pretty much any headset with any console and still hear surround sound and everything that console and headset has to offer. You won't need a mix amp. It doesn't matter if the headset is wireless or wired. Just make sure you can connect it to your PC either through a USB dongle, USB cable, or a 3.5 millimeter jack. All you're going to need is your PC, your console, a monitor with a headphone jack, and a 3.5 millimeter male to male audio cable. Now you may also need a ground loop isolator just in case you hear any static or buzzing when doing this. You can pick up all of this stuff for under 20 bucks and I will make sure to leave it all linked down below for you guys. With the PS5 and Xbox Series X, a ton of you have been asking me, is there a way to hear both your next gen console and your PC at the same time? So I figured I'd go ahead and make this quick video for you guys so you can go ahead and get the ultimate gaming experience with any headset and any console with your PC. For the first step, you're gonna go ahead and connect one end of the male 3.5 millimeter cable to the back of your monitor where the headphone jack is. Then with the other end, you're gonna go ahead and connect that to your microphone port on the back or the front of your PC. Once you have all of this set up, you should be good to go as long as your headset's connected to your PC. Now, if not, now we're gonna go ahead and dive into some troubleshooting to go ahead and fix this issue. First thing you're gonna do is manage your sound devices in your sound settings, and you're gonna go ahead and make sure you don't have anything related to any speakers you're using disabled. So any sound cards, any sound speakers, make sure they're not in the disabled section. For example, for me, it says Realtek High Definition Audio or Speakers Realtek Audio. Make sure that none of these are in that disabled section. If they are, just right click on them and enable them. Once you get that out of the way, the last thing you need to do is head over and find your sound control panel wherever it is. For this current version of Windows 10, I can just right click on the volume speaker and open up sound settings. Then on the right side up here, click sound control panel. And when it opens up, you're going to head over to the recording tab and head down to your microphone speaker that you enabled earlier if it wasn't already enabled. You're going to right click on the microphone and check the box that says listen to this device and that's pretty much it. If you get an echo, which I don't think you will, just uncheck your other microphone you're using or make sure to mute one of them in OBS if you're planning on streaming or recording with this setup. Not saying that you will have to, but just in case. Now there is one possible deal breaker with this scenario and it's pretty much irrelevant to everyone that I know. The only thing that you can't do is talk to anyone in party chat or game chat on your console. You can still hear them, you just can't talk to them. Everyone I know uses Discord or TeamSpeak. Now, if you're playing cross-platform games like Warzone or Fortnite and you're on PC, you obviously won't have to worry about this because you can hear and still talk to everyone. This only applies to console party chat and specifically PlayStation because with the Xbox Game Bar and companion app on PC, you can still hear everyone in your party chat and listen to your Xbox and PC at the same time. If you do want to get around this, you can go ahead and pick up an Astro Mix Amp and set it up the same way using the same method I showed you. But then what you're going to do is connect your Mix Amp to your console through the USB and digital optical audio cable, and then connect the 3.5 millimeter cable from the aux port on the back of your mix amp to the microphone port on your PC. Then you're gonna have to run another aux port from your mix amp to your headset, which for me is a pain and not worth it, just so I can go ahead and talk to someone in console game chat. Just buy the game on PC at that point and eliminate all those steps, or just connect the headset directly to your console. Now I know a ton of you guys have been asking me how to connect my console to my PC so I can hear both. This is how you do it, and I really do hope this video helped you guys. If it did, please make sure you smash that like button for me and subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure you get the channel to 10,000 subs for me here within the next couple days. I really appreciate you guys. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, make sure you go ahead and drop them down below in the comment section for me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.